Hi, I am Akshay Gupta and I work for BMC Actium Orchestrator product. This video is related to continuous compliance for server runbook. In this video, we will see how to configure approvals in BMC server automation product for continuous compliance for servers runbook. In this video, we will see how to configure approvals for various job types in BSA. We will also see how to assign job approval permissions for various users in BSA. These steps can be done via Blade Logic Server Automation Console. Let us first look at how we can configure job approvals for various job types in BSA. Let's go to Blade Logic Server Automation Console for doing these activities. Log into Blade Logic Server Automation Console via BL Admin User Role. This user is the admin user of Blade Logic Server Automation and it has all the permissions needed to configure various job approvals for the jobs. Go to the Configuration tab. Go to the Approval Configuration. Job Approval Required Configuration window opens. This window tells for which job approval required is set. By default, we have approval required set as no for all the jobs. It means whenever any job of this type will be executed, approval information window will not be required. So for any job where we want ITSM approval, we need to select approval required as yes. We can select approval required as yes for all the jobs. For the demo purpose, let us select approval required as yes for file deploy job. Click on OK. Now we already have one demo job on this environment. Let us try to execute that. Right click on the job. Click on execute. Now we get one window that says enter approval information. In this window, we can select various approval type available. We have three approval types, change management manual approval, automatic approval and emergency approval. When we select change management manual approval, ticket will go to ITSM and when change approval approves the ticket, job will be executed. In case of automatic and emergency approval, approval from change manager is not required and its execution will be started when the ticket is created in ITSM and is automatically approved. This approval configuration options enables us to configure whether or not job of a given type requires BMC Remedy ITSM approval or not. Let's cancel this window. Now let us see another part of this video that is assign job approval permissions to various user. For doing this, we need to log into Blade Logic Server Automation Console via RBAC Admin User. So I have already logged in with RBAC Admin User role in Blade Logic Server Automation Console. Go to the roles and go to the users. We have a role as QA engineer and I have created one demo user for the demo purpose. This demo user has a role as QA engineer. So whatever permissions are assigned to QA engineer's role will be applicable to demo user role, demo user user. Let's go to QA engineer role and see what permission this role has. Go to system and then at the right hand side we can see the approval permissions that this role has. So it has only remedy manual approval permissions. Now let us log in to blade console via demo user and try to execute a job.
go to the jobs go to the demo i already have a job as test created let's try to execute it click on execute so now here we see approval type is coming only as manual because the role that is assigned to this user has only execution permission as manual approval now let's try to change this permission so again go back to our back admin user and search for the emergency and automatic permissions so now these are the emergency and automatic permission let's give these permissions to the qa engineer role click on save again go back to the demo user refresh it now execute this now we can see automatic and emergency approval permissions are also added to this user this procedure can be used for assigning permissions to different bnc blade users so that we can have a control on the job execution i hope this video was informative to you thanks for watching